hello, and welcome to your favorite channel for all things Roblox, Bloxy Banner. I hope you're having an amazing day, and in today's video, we're going to know if Megan Plays is officially done with Roblox. But before we begin with today's video, I want you to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and turn on notifications so you don't miss any of our upcoming videos. And comment on which squad member is your favorite. But without further ado, let's get right into it. Roblox YouTuber Megan Plays continuously rose in prominence, with now having about 3.6 million subscribers. And if you're in his shoes, you know this is already making a stable career, and you'd want to make sure that you'll take care of it, because not everyone has the privilege to grow their subscribers this much. Well, I hate to break it to you, but even the biggest YouTubers have their own downfall. Just like Megan Plays, we all know her for playing Let's Plays and other stuff like Diablo, Sims 4, Roblox, and Minecraft. And with these games, you know that her influence is just crazy, right? Imagine being a YouTuber and playing different games. I mean, the power you hold, right? But unfortunately, it wasn't like that for Megan Plays. I mean, we all know that she's been in the YouTube industry for about 7 years now, and that's no joke. That's actually a really long time. Since she mainly plays Roblox, but sadly after playing for 7 years, she's had an intense and exhausting burnout. So on top of playing for 7 years now, keep in mind that Megan Plays also uploads videos every day for about a year or two. I mean, you can expect that it gets really boring after that. And Megan tried to, to find a remedy for this and pressed pause to take a break from YouTube for about a month. And in the span of the month that she took a break, she reflected on many things on whether her videos are doing well or she still loves what she's doing and what she puts out. Then she came to a realization that she's not genuinely happy with the content that she makes. To make up for this, she decided to make another channel for a lot of Roblox Heavens content. From there, she started to make a lot of reaction channels on top of all the content that she makes. And it was, for a lack of a better term, nasty. Now, this is where her statistics started to get very discouraging, to say the least. Her views at that time were just low compared to the videos that she produced before which actually created a lot of confusion for people. A lot of her fans actually started to conclude that Megan Plays is indeed having a hard time knowing what she actually wants to do in her YouTube career, which is just making any sense. I mean, up until today, her views hardly got a thousand compared to her millions of views back then. Well, she answered all these reoccurring theories when she made a video addressing the issue titled We Need to Talk About This. She started the video directly by pointing out the issue and said, I want to take a second and talk to you guys about something that's kind of going on right now. She proceeded to say that, as you guys know, I've been uploading daily to YouTube for a few years and I am, needless to say, very, very lost right now at this exact moment. That's it. After seven years of just plainly producing videos for YouTube, she found herself lost despite her success. She expanded her explanation by saying, I'm making this video because lately, I've not been feeling really proud of the content I've been producing to this channel. Which really gives a lot of confirmation as the theories by her fans. She even addressed her existing channels, aside from her main channel. She also said, I know that I have a few other channels that I am so dedicatedly working on, but on this channel, my Adopt Me channel, I feel like I don't know what I'm doing, which is really strange because I've been doing Adopt Me for a few years now. Like, close to religiously. She wanted to be open with her subscribers and loyal viewers because she values them so much. I guess I just want to come on here and kindly tell you guys that I feel a bit lost. I feel distracted and I'm not sure what you guys want to see. 
and I'm coming to you guys for help. She admitted that she was actually lacking in new ideas to post on her channel. I feel like I've just been kind of waking up looking for an idea and then posting or just trying to get by and creating content so that I don't let you guys down. I haven't really been taking days off because I really just want to make sure that I'm posting what you guys want to see. Because of this, many people actually think that Megan plays while in deep quit Roblox. And her videos and confession actually backs this up. So at this point, anything is possible. But one thing is for sure, her fans will be with her until the end of the race. That's all we have for you guys today. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, then be sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already for more Roblox content like this and much, much more. We'll see you guys in the next time. And until then, take care and stay hydrated. Bye-bye.